3D laser scanning is a recent approach by the construction industry to ensure that the completed structure is built according to the design model. However, this is often done manually, making it resource intensive and time consuming. As part of the 5G at Sentosa program, the Building and Construction Authority is using Singtel 5G connected autonomous robots with mounted 3D laser scanners for seamless live stream remote scanning of the building works at a 5G enabled smart construction site. Every time we want to go down the site, we want to scan our project site uh, to update into the, our BIM model. We have to send uh, resources down to site. So we're taking them away from more important work they could be doing back in the office. By using these autonomous robots, it is possible to eradicate the manual setups of equipment at multiple locations and overcome the repetitive manual scanning tasks, often constrained by limited manpower. So when we had the opportunity to work with uh, Deconstruct and Singtel uh, to explore the use of an autonomous robot that can actually do that scanning task um, for me and replace the use of my manpower, obviously we jumped to the idea. Given the current situation with COVID and also the fact that the construction industry is ripe for disruption, autonomous robotics with the Deconstruct autonomous robotics stack is actually a very powerful tool to alleviate and address a lot of these issues in construction today. 5G is actually key and critical to our robotics deployment efforts, especially in the world of remote operations. We can actually scan the point clouds and construct a BIM model from our robots on site remotely and then transfer them for gammon construction employees to actually use for building inspection. By using the robot with the laser scanner mounted on it, BIM modelers can plan the route from the head office within the BIM model itself and then execute a command. The robot will move along that scan path on site and do the scanning without anyone needing to leave the office. On completion of the scanning, the robot can then transmit the data back 